shooting at you. God damn it! He completely bypassed the other guy. Damn! He really wants a chicken wing. So who's up for some split gate? <laughs> Blue Griffin, are you talking about like smoking weed getting high? Because whenever Aeon smokes and gets high, he's a fucking prodigy. No, for like, some reason. The, we've agreed, we found this out as a rule that if you're playing golf with your friends, somehow for some reason, you will somehow be better at it when stoned. <laughs> I don't know why, yeah. but okay. It's like, true. They're not anxious. <laughs> there's also like a jank to the. I, I was talking about this to a, a guy at work, funny enough. But there's a jank to that game that you understand perfectly when high. Ooh, oh, hello. I get that. Uh, okay, yeah, better, better. Boosh. Oh, hello. <laughs> Home run. Oh, already loading. That didn't take long at all. Uh, they usually take about maybe a minute or so. Who the fuck yeah. is this guy? DJ O seventeen four zero eighty four. Peanut butter jelly time. Peanut butter jelly time. That's <laughs> <For> one chamber. <laughs> I mean, I quote the Badger song every so often. Badger, 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 mushroom, mushroom. 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 A bunch of, bunch of, bunch of. <laughs> I quote things a lot. But I have various sources. Alan, drink some fucking water. <laughs> yeah, seriously. I just took a sip. <coughs> I just took a sip, Alan, don't worry. Sounds like you need another. Damn it. I'll kiss I'm my ass. You. This was a bad place to go to in this, mo in this mode. Oh well. I'm still trying to find somebody. <coughs> I found one person, and that's it. Are you okay? Yeah. God damn it! Huh. I wasn't fast enough. <laughs> I got three kills with that. I got a triple kill. <laughs> you lucky son of a bitch. It was you and some two guys after you. Oh Jesus! Ah! I gotta, bitch. I gotta practice my hey, reflexes man. better. <laughs> and then somebody <laughs> elbowed you. That was funny. Ah, what the fuck happened? I'm just running all of a sudden I just go dirt. Ha. Ah. Bye, Jilly. D <laughs> what's, what's happening? I'm just running along, all of a sudden, I just dead. I don't even see any gunshots. Jelly dead. I don't see anything because. Yeah, the reason you don't is because, uh. Um, everybody here dies in one shot. Yep. No, it's not that. It's, uh, your stream is very. Hold on. Yeah, like, I get it's jank. I'm gonna quit it because my PC is kind of heaving. Yeah, so yeah it's a little too powerful. You're good. What is? <clears throat> No, not this. It's uh, I have too many things running at the same time. Ah, uh, okay. well. God maybe. damn it! I Don't saw him too. Yeah, Wait, I is know. he got a flamethrower? But, uh, oh. there's nothing I can do about it now. Yeah, got me. That's fair. I was doing pretty well, and I'm tied now. Ah, damn it! Uh, the thing is that I can never seem to. And this is kind of the problem with this game, is that whether or not you're good or not is more... There is a reflex game involved, don't get me wrong, but a lot of it is... There's a lot more of it that is kind of... How do I put this? It really is, like, God based on a lot... An, a metric assload of luck and yeah, spawn maybe. points. Yep. So it's more of a gamble whenever this happens? 
<laughs> kind of, sort of. Like, your reflexes are still the skill part about it, but, you know, like... Bullshit, I hit Somebody you. just... Ah! No, there were times oh, I shot, shot you, too, and you were still giggling about it, so, ha, uh, you didn't. Uh, damn. Okay. No, like, I'm... No, like, I, I'm still enjoying the game and such. I'm just so confused. Like, you just all of a sudden, oh, now he's just suddenly collapsing. Like, I don't see a line of gunshot of any sort. Which is weird. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Cause it's that's because these are carbines. So that, like, yeah, that threw me off so much. Yeah, the weird thing is, is that this is, like, aside from the portal mechanics, everything else, it's kind of like... Well, okay, I'm not going to say it's the same game engine, but it's very comparable to Halo, where it's a first-person shooter. And, but, like... It's just saying it's like Halo because it's first-person shooter is a bit like saying what... What Call of Duty is, or... I mean, Call of Duty technically has a turret section, so I suppose you could say Call of Duty is an on-rail shooter. <laughs> Apparently, the Splitgate 2 is going to be more of a hero-based shooter with the portal mechanics, so... I don't mind. Yeah, like, as long as they don't screw it up or pull a fin concord. Finishing off what I said earlier, because whenever I was playing uh, PvP and, like, Halo games, I would always get too frustrated. And yet the same kind of thing happens in Splitgate, and I don't even care. Like, I'm just having a good laugh. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's fun. Because the, the portaling, all the physics, I just have fun with it in general. I, well, I, even I, so, I, like, I... Do... I... I don't I'm even use... Halo than this, but I do yeah. like it. Like, I don't even use the Halo, um... Not the halo. I don't even use the portal grenades or however that thing works. Portal gun? Oh, I tied for something. Oh, yeah, no, you want to use the grenades at some point, though, because um, if an enemy opens a portal behind you, it can sometimes be more useful to just close it rather than <laughs> try and shoot him through it. Yeah. Ah, so that's how... I thought the guy ahead of me shot me. <laughs> yeah, no, you can... There are sometimes when sniping, uh, in particular... If it says, oh, get kills through portal, the actual easiest way for you to do that is not the rocket launcher trap, because I know everyone's going to say, oh, just use the rocket launcher trap. And I oh, see what you mean. You that works. But just get a... Here's an easier one. Just get a sniper rifle, set a portal, and snipe people through the portal. <laughs> uh... Like, for real, that's like one of the... One that, of sounds like, that sounds like one of the most, like, epic camping methods. It kind of is, but just keep in mind, if someone can... It's, it's an instance of getting lucky because they can't see through your portal with exact detail. The reticle will still turn red if they point at you, though. So, there have been times where I've gotten accidental... Like, accidental is in, like, I saw the reticle turn red, so I didn't intend to shoot. But by sheer luck, it just happened to just hit the guy in the head. And it was an instant headshot. But I couldn't have known that because on my end, I see a black hole with a red reticle. I need to go for three more uh, holes. Giggity. All right. Ah, a little bit of Jersey Mike's time. I'll get a few bites in. I'll probably have some more tomorrow. Mm. If you want to try the, uh, nah, probably too much. This, the, the COD beta itself is still, like, 137 gigabytes, so... I'm gonna add two more game modes and do this roulette style. Okay. Okay. So we got four game modes in tow. I am gonna end it on Fiesta, just because that's the easiest icebreaker non-competitive. The other two are kind of slightly aimy, but not instant kill. In my opinion, I like these better than one in the chamber. Although I do, I do like one in the chamber, but I like these a little bit better. Oh, what the hell! Oh, the game started. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Well, we're doing the loaded thing while we're waiting for a game. Oh god, not the carbine! Please, no. Damn it! Oh, of course. At least with the pistol, it's semi-automatic, so you could possibly get, like, a freaking uh, headshot. Yeah, it's just, the problem is, even if you score a headshot with the pistol, the damage on it is what only the hell? better than a normal... Oh, Instagib! Yeah, that's what I voted yeah, on. I like, I like Instagib because, in my opinion, Instagib is the better one in the chamber because it's, it's more chaotic. It's more fun. Oh, like, you still that. die in one shot, but there's, like, a... 
you know what I mean, right? There's like an arcade zap zing yeah. to it that just feels more fun. Especially if you're using a controller and you can feel the laser. Yeah, I am too. Are you using one? Yeah, I'm using an Xbox because I can't use my PlayStation controller for some reason. No offense, dude, but why would you want to? <laughs> like, the PlayStation controller is fucking puny, and the triggers always... Like, no offense to Sony, but the triggers have always fucking sucked on a DualShock. Honestly, I like the DualSense design, and I like all the haptic feedback stuff it has. And, like, the, well, the biggest reason is because my old Xbox... Oh, is this that whole giant beam thing? Well, not really broken, oh. but... It Control. Okay. The, uh, it's instant fire. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, this one instant. It's instant fire, but you do have to pull the trigger. Shoot. Ah, damn it. Uh, some guy named Paul Arno seventy got me. Is this a team? Uh, no, yeah, it is. It. Uh, no, no, we're it's uh it's it's uh yeah free for all right now. Yeah. Okay. How the? Oh, hey, bro. Yeah, oh, by the way, punch, you cannot punch people to death in this mode, yeah. or you can, ah. but it's not an instant kill like it was before. Shoot. It is not I the not uh, doing well. instant kill it was prior. God damn it! That one was the you beam know, gun. Man. I haven't gotten a single kill yet. Okay, there we go. Got ya. And then broke, oh. and then you kill me after I killed him. Oh, by the way, good job on beating the, um... Good job on beating, uh, one in the chamber goal, or goal, Riley. Oh, thank time. you. Also, yeah, uh... No, I got a killing spree on Damn. your kill. <laughs> yeah. I know Jelly is definitely in the lead. They sniped me through a portal just as I closed it. Jelly's been killing me nonstop. God damn oh, it! Shit. Jelly's been making my body into Jelly using the power of railguns. <laughs> damn it! Fuck. Way yet, way yet. Peanut butter jelly time. Boy. Peanut butter jelly. Peanut Boy. butter jelly. Peanut butter jelly with a baseball bat. Baseball bat. Now, if only we had the baseball bats this round to kill jelly with. God, that shit's funny as hell. Yep. We're, as we're singing the song, we're going peanut butter, jelly, peanut butter, jelly, peanut butter. Jelly. Oh, I got, <laughs> dude. Your kill was another killing spree for me again. Aw, you're welcome. I almost tied the leader and then didn't. Yeah, that Ooh. location is broken on this game mode. I am not doing well. Fear. Oh, how the shit. <laughs> yeah, dude, I noticed that about one in the chamber, and uh, <laughs> both of them are really like, if you're in the mood to win, then everything clicks. But if you like, I noticed especially in the beginning, like if you don't start Damn. in all these games, if you don't like start well, then the rest of the game kind of sucks. But if you pop off like something amazing, then the rest of the round usually goes amazing. I get that. Yeah, I can understand that. Where the fuck is that guy if he's not? Oh, there are four above me. Oh, fucking hell! Whatever. <coughs> Portal. I still need to go through more portals. Damn it! Damn it. <laughs> How? Oh, well. Oh, I was the game losing yeah. kill, damn it. <laughs> I got sixth place. I did horrible that round. Right. right. I'm gonna inject a little bit of purple octane into my mixture. <laughs> Sour D for mental sharpness and that, and if I want to say Hail Satan and take a hit, I literally have a vape with an upside down red cross on a black vape from the <coughs> the line of this is called black craft and the strain is called nocturnal i want to try that when i'm down yeah no trust me it'll definitely be around when you're here and it's a really good indica <coughs> like it doesn't like knock you out it just makes you feel really good <coughs> oh excuse me uh, how many more do i need to do i still need to go through three portals uh... I mean, <laughs> actually, wait, how about this? Because FFA Brawl isn't a... <laughs> and Dusky, yeah. you're giving me ideas. 
Oh. You sound tired. I am very high right now. Oh, okay. <laughs> <coughs> I was gonna say, going like, down. Dusky, go sleepy now. No. <laughs> and also, stay awake and dirt. Yeah, besides, I didn't dismiss her yet, Goldie. Alright. Also, sorry if I, if calling you Dusky was weird. I just, it oh. just... It just it slipped out of my mouth. I'm nor normally I just say dusk. Don't overthink things, my dude. Yeah, no, it is usually the back name I use, but I get you. Yeah, and oh, you have you apologized. Are... So Ooh. Okay. Yeah. <gasps> gotcha. Oh, that was fun. <laughs> that was fun for the two seconds you had a weapon. Yeah. <laughs> I love you. I love you. Kalel. You're being precious, I and I can't like wait Kalel. to see you. Ah, Damn it. Yeah. And, <clears throat> but yeah, um, so yeah, I've injected a little bit of purple octane, which, um, this one is one I got for, uh, pain killing. It has a nifty little thing in it, too. Uh, so, uh, the chemicals in it are, one of them was THC, it was THCA, THC, I think it's P or B. It was one of the ones that I needed because I need it as a painkiller and sleep aid. Uh, the other one is HXY11, so it's literally an edible high and a pen. Okay. Mm -hmm. Ooh. I got it as here. And the strain, if you want to know, especially Riley, is uh, Purple <laughs> Octane. Yes, I haven't tried that in a while. Um, I have not tried many of the, and many of the purple. F I know it's going to sound weird to just say to people, but I haven't tried much of the purple family. Yeah, they got a they got a sniper uh, scouting <coughs> thing and All right, where is he? set up over there. Ah, damn! Oh shit! Yeah, ah, a, damn it! The yeah, they're setting up a portal snipe network. Yep. Watch out. Oh shit! The back of the old spot. Yeah, I haven't had much from the. All right, so, oh hello! Oh, so, damn! Uh, raspberry. How, My reflexes are fucking raspberry. terrible. There we go. Ah, damn! I was gonna try to pull a fast one and nice. get him, but he got me first. Nice, bro. We double teamed him. We're getting fucking hazed here. Oh, yeah. Um, We're catching up. Yeah, I know. Uh, I got Raspberry Kush, which I'm saving the last of that for Dusky. Oh. It's an older one. Uh, I got my Black Crab Damn. Nocturnal, which is Delta 9P, so it's like if Delta 9 was ah, just making it an edible rather than... Uh, it's like if they filtered it through your liver already, it's really weird, but it's interesting. Um, uh, I have a... Let's see, I have a Sour Diesel Adios pen, so that's a mix of, like, everything. <laughs> and just Sour D and, uh... Damn it! My Purple Octane uh, Heavy Hitter <laughs> Looper. I haven't. I am excited. I don't know why, but like. What? Just don't oh! Me that's anymore. right. Melee but only dude, knocks down half the met. Sorry. I need to. When you visit here sometime, I need to take you on a trip to the one of the Delta it? head shops and introduce you what this is like before Damn I'm it. off the stuff. Okay. That's the condition before I'm off. Before I no longer do that. Before I no longer do that stuff. Or at least not do it constantly. But yeah, uh, definitely try and try and work your way up to that because here's the thing here's the thing dude like if we really oh, wanted shit, to sorry. There, are tiny house rent there are tiny house rentals here that are only like 55 dollars a night i wouldn't mind getting Why it just to introduce you to stuff to some cool uh shit on a, a, a two night weekend Ooh, that would be fun sometime yeah and dude all you need is a free weekend that's true um because there's a there's a tiny house community that I used to deliver to in Austin. They're really, really premium, and a couple of them are Airbnbs. So, uh, I yeah, yeah, but they were they were like for their quality, they're actually really cheap to rent as an Airbnb. They're only like fifty five a night, and it slept six, and not like in an awkward way. They have like they have this really interesting measure of space saving where there is a dedicated master bedroom. And then a loft Shit. that just has two beds in it. Yeah, I've seen those. The yeah, and it was really cool. like, and actually, it wasn't like overly, oh. it wasn't like poorly spaced or anything. It was like roomy. Ah, damn it! 
I'm still interested in one of those long term, but at the same time, I'm. Uh... Also, if I remember correctly, Riley, I think you can bring. You might be able to bring some of the stuff you get here back with you, depending on where your air, airplane flies into. Because if I remember right, I think you. Don't quote me on this. You can legally bring it into Massachusetts, I think. Well, I have managed to uh, bring vapes back with me through the <coughs> airline on occasion. <laughs> Yeah, I'm just saying that, like, the rules are a lot more lax with Delta stuff, because I went between yeah. two states where the Damn. normal stuff isn't legal, and they allowed it, and it, that was Kansas and Texas. Okay. So, that's what I'm saying, you might like it, but, um, yeah, I need to introduce you to all these old chemicals and crazy-ass experiments that we got going on here. I'm gonna flex on you by taking you by getting some of the pens from a gas station, just to illustrate that, yes, you can get it from a gas station. Oh, oh, nice. Excuse me. I, oh, I should tell you about some of the stuff I was offered at Everfree later. No, dude, uh, me and Dusk at HarmonyCon, um, we were like the walking party and everyone appreciated us because effectively I had nine vape pens <laughs> of different strains with different temp with uh, different strains of weed and different variants of weed in them. And effectively what would happen is if you knew that I had these and you walked up to me and said, Hey, Aeon, I'd like to feel good. I'd be like, okay, let me give you a prescription. How do you want to feel? So I had a strain for like one that makes you feel happy, one that kills anxiety and rage, one that kill, one that makes you aroused, one not like in a roofy way, just in a like you have to be like predisposed in the mood and like the person, so it's not like that. But even then, I, I let you know what all these do. And it says, well, I want to feel happy and I want to feel this, um, or hey, I want to feel high, but I don't want to like lose myself. And I'll be like, say no more, fam. Take one second hit, <laughs> take a three second hit of this, and a ten second hit of this, and then you're good. And I had to well, lose. Yeah, nice. and Dusk brought yeah. vodka. Okay. So I was the high yeah. guy. So I was Dr. Feelgood, and she was uh, the bartender. Uh, nice. It was nice. I actually brought two drinks down, but one was just for you. It was um, the blue, blue one, right? Yeah, the blue. It was really good. I loved how strong it was. It was a gin. Yeah, it was a really strong one, too. Yeah. Mm, Loved it. I mean, I'm going to be going through there again, so I'll see what they have. I want to try and bring you something new each time. No, I love that. Thank you. And the Pure Song was also really good. Yeah, it was really, really cool. That bottle, though. Very vampiric. <laughs> oh, that's something you can do over here. We can, like, whatever you bring, we can, like, get little ingredients to mix cocktail, like, a bunch of cocktails with it. I like that. And just every time we make a new drink, it, we just have to make a different cocktail. Yeah, I would recommend, like, something more Well, you're the one who uh, takes the Yeah, it's true. Mm. Which yes, alcohol yeah. do you not like, if any? I... Oh, I'm not sure. Down. I hear that. Um, <laughs> I don't think there is one that I necessarily don't like. Or okay. if there is, I've yet to discover it. The so only like, thing that I'm weird around is Merlot wine. Okay, well, I'm not gonna huh. be bringing you wine, so don't worry. That's fine. Like, and besides, like, one, you can do, a, you can have a lot more fun with liquor and two. And as much as I do love wine and beer, uh, there, there's a different atmosphere for it. But also, uh, especially when it comes to Merlot, I don't know what it is. I, like, I don't know if it's just because I've had cheap Merlot, because yeah, I tried it out of curiosity, just off a gas station shelf when I was like. Looking at oh, a well, bit first of, of all, you're getting wine from a gas station. Yeah, yeah, I get it, but it was oh, like, you are <laughs> at, least, wine. at least, like, if I get, like, um, like say, Moscato from a gas station, it's a wine that doesn't make you, like, depressed or anything. Like, yeah, it's not hard to mess up with Moscato. Whereas, yeah, but Moscato's it, also a white. Yeah, and, well, the other thing, too, is, like, even, uh, even, like, Cabernet, like, if I just want some yeah. Cab, like, if I want some cab, like, usually, like, even uh -oh. the most generic brand oh. of cab doesn't taste bad. I kind of like cab for that. It's, it's really a very forgiving. Yeah, it's very forgiving, and it's oh. like, even if you get low-quality cab, it's still not bad wine. Yeah. I had to get that out of me, so, Jesus. Uh, <clears throat> yeah, I think, right. it was, I think it was like, I was probably trying to go for cab, but they just didn't have it, and I wanted something <laughs> red, and I saw they had Merlot, and I'm like, well, I haven't tried this before. And I don't know if it, but I guess, like, if you got bad Merlot, <laughs> it really does, like, depress you. Like, holy fuck. Well, I, don't know. I, I do want to try some good Merlot to give it a shot, a better shot. But if you ask me my favorite, though, if you ask me my favorite red, because I just. <laughs> it's 
It's either Cab or Seven Deadly Zins. <laughs> which was made by two uh, Catholic boys who make uh, who blended uh, seven uh, different Zinfandels together masterfully. But it doesn't taste like white noise. It tastes really good. Um, nice. and it, it was made by these two Catholic boys, so they made the bottle in, into looking like a gothic demonic contract in blood. And it said the seven deadlies, and it's called the seven deadly zins. Mm. You know, the funny thing every time... Go ahead. I wanted to ask, I wanted to ask you guys, though, uh, starting with Death, Destiny Red, what was your favorite red wine? Or, if you guys have one. I don't like wine. I enjoy wine, but I don't have... I'm not passionate enough to kind of, like, go over which ones I like. I'm more into beer. And you... That is fair. Yeah. I'm yes. more into, like, mixed drinks and stuff. I, I was asking, what's your favorite... I was asking people, because you got me on the topic, what's your favorite red wine? Um, Mine is uh, the Spindly Zins, probably. Yeah, right. my, and maybe, if you just ask me, generic, maybe cab. But specifically, my, Spindly Zins is like a bottle I'll have. So Wait, what's My dad this? recently found... Sorry, what? No, 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 I'm just reading the chat. Go ahead. Okay. Um, My dad recently found a white sangria which is like mango flavored Ooh, are you so that is a sangria but are but like do you like any reds Red, i'm not a wine person that's in the first place i'm really not good with wine no no that's oh. fair um bro are you gonna start the match yeah sorry okay we did sniper frenzy so the last one left <laughs> this is just for shits and giggles this is swat oh okay so Golden, this is also, it's like one in the chamber, again, but, difference, it's only an instant kill if you hit the head, but you don't need to hit people with a sniper rifle in the head. You're given a carbine and a BR, I would, uh, my recommendation, you Golden, switch to the BR, because the three bullet spread Ooh. makes targeting the head Ooh. easier. Um, and yeah, if you hit the body, it does normal damage, but oh, if you hit the head, go. yeah, I wasn't gonna win that, I wasn't gonna win that, I had a BR and a pistol. Oh, for a second, I thought I went over a cliff. You know, Chad, the thing I find hilarious hey, is that whenever it comes to having a quote-unquote 10 out of 10 of a burp, it's always when there's, like, an enormous amount of air in the pit of my stomach, and I'm just trying to get it out. Speaking of... <gasps> oh, I had to get some of that out. That's not a 10. I know oh. that for sure. Oh, pistols. Well, I'm not saying we gotta do pistol swat. That's only if, um... Pistol SWAT is everyone is only armed with a pistol. If you hit the body, it's the normal damage, but if you hit the head, it kills you instantly. Huh. We can rack up kit pistol kills with that, that's for sure. Yeah, like, if you wanted pistol kills, or you enjoyed the idea of using the pistol but wanted it to be, like, effective or somewhat skill-based, that is your... Pistol SWAT is your game type. And yeah, like I said, Goldie, my recommendation is, uh... <clears throat> swap to the BR if it's not already on it, and use the bullet spread to your advantage. Okay. I think I have it equipped already. It like yeah, it, you already do. I saw you spawn in. All right. It's already out. Be careful about walking in the open because if you get hit in the head, it's all over. Yeah, I see a portal there. If you don't have your challenges, you can get them here. Up, oh, someone You're got portaling got... in the back here. Yeah. You gotta go in the sniper position. Yeah, I. They dropped one of those. Uh... Oh, hello! Damn it! He got me before he, he killed me just before he killed you. Dude, we got. I got jumped. Dude, we both got jumped. Still need to go through one more port. Oh shit! Uh, hit, motherfucker! Oh yeah, I finally got that dental implant too. What's that? Oh, Gee, got him! Now it Wait, look like what? I got into a bar oh, fight. Oh, Jesus! Good. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Where is the enemy? 
They are sniping all around. They're they're oh, no. handling most of the area. They're coming towards you. Thing. Yeah, they keep killing me in the oh. middle area. So Shit. watch out for them. Top part, middle area. Nice. I did, but I know he's gonna come up for me now. Yep. Someone got me when I when I spotted other. <laughs> yeah, one of them was like top of the map. Yeah, I'm trying to see if I can sneak up behind them. Oh, there's a portal. There you go through a portal. There we go. Ah, how the frick? Damn! They're so fast. You're too slow. You're too slow. Actually, I remember um, this uh, an oddly specific memory here. Uh, this was like back in the like late 2000s when YouTube videos were much more, uh, what's the term, amateur? Yeah. Uh, there was like a compilation of like funny moments from Super Smash Brothers Brawl. And one of them that I remember was one of the players was getting uh, Sonic to do his taunt going on, you're too slow. But before he could finish his sentence, he gets hit with a bomb and gets knocked out of the ring. So it's like, you're too slow. <laughs> And the timing was just uh, impeccable. Oh, was it Brawl Taunts? Yeah. Yeah, the Kerberfer's uh, Brawl Taunts. I love his animated series back in those days. Shit, 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 shit. He made, like, multiple of those, too. With, uh, what was it, King DDD doing the Big A dance. <laughs> Every time I think of DDD, I think of that tantrum he had at the end of uh, Kirby's Dreamland on the Game Boy. Uh, Kirby's Dreamland was such a good game. I think Kirby Superstar like remade the game. I don't know. It's been years since I played the game, but I remember that it kind of gave me like close memories of what Kirby's Dreamland was. I don't know exactly. Get out of here, fucker! I, mean, reason I like Nightmare on Dreamland or Nightmare. On uh, once you beat the game, you can play as Meta Knight. <laughs> now, granted, he couldn't do any of Kirby's. Ah! <laughs> so pretty cool play as. Shit! No! Oh, crap! Oh, crap! Ugh. I'm doing decent. Let's see if I can catch up a bit. Oh! You son of a bitch! Ah, guy sniping in the middle. Watch out. Oh, what's going on with my game? Wait, what do you mean, what's going on with the game? I just see a black screen. Oh, shit. Okay, there we go. There we go. Uh, I guess I just had to pause and, un and yeah, resume. Shit, I didn't know that would cost us the game. Yeah, just kill somebody before the game ended. I was eating my fucking sandwich, man. Oh. Was... Yeah, you you were gonna live you were gonna live through that one. Yeah.